As the name suggests, a bending moment is a force that causes something to bend. If we think of a typical banana, we'd say it is bendiest in the middle. If we'd load a beam and it deflects in a similar shape, we'd also say it is bendiest in the middle, or in more technical terms, its bending moment is highest. As structural engineers, we use bending moments to find out where something experienced bending, and we want to put a value to that bending, and the more something bends, the more likely it is to fail or snap. If we think more closely at about a single point in the banana or beam during bending, we'd see that the top of the banana squishes together and the bottom stretches apart. This is how the bending effect is formed. But what's happening either end of the banana? The bending force is less the closer the load is to the support. Also, the area of maximum bending moves closer to the load too. At the very end of the beam or banana, the bending gets smaller so it is effectively straight and we say there's zero bending. Understanding where and how much beams, slabs, columns and walls bend helps us as structural engineers decide where we do and don't need strength in our structural elements and buildings.